Welcome to the program and instruction video for the 7.4 volt DC tubular motor. This motor comes with an inbuilt radio receiver, battery and electronic limit stop. To connect or sync the transmitter to the motor, first press the PROG button on the motor. This will wake the motor up from standby mode and you'll be presented with a bleep. Press the PROG button once more and then pressing up on the transmitter, the motor will shunt once more to confirm the action. In the event that you need to change the direction of travel, press and hold the stop button on the transmitter for five seconds. The motor will shunt once, and then press down on the transmitter. The motor will shunt once again to confirm the action. To set your top limit stop, run the motor to the top position and press stop. Then press PROG on the back of the transmitter. Fine tune the motor to the exact position and press stop again. Press PROG on the back of the transmitter. The motor will shunt to confirm the action. You've now set the top limit stop. To set your second or bottom limit stop, Run the motor to the desired position. Press PROG on the back of the transmitter for one second. The motor will shunt. Press the PROG button on the back of the transmitter once more. The motor will shunt to confirm the action. You've now set the bottom limit stop. To set an other or middle limit stop, Run the motor to the desired position and press stop. Press PROG on the back of the transmitter for one second. The motor will shunt and then press PROG once more and the motor will shunt one final time to confirm the action. To bypass any middle or other limit stops, press and hold either the up or down arrow on the transmitter until the transmitter flashes twice. To delete a limit stop, Run the motor to the limit stop you wish to delete. Press and hold the PROG button for five seconds. The motor will initially shunt once, and then will shunt once more to confirm the action. This limit stop's now been deleted. It's important to know all limit stops can be deleted with the exception of the first or top limit stop. To delete this, you would need to perform a factory reset on the motor. To perform a factory restart, press and hold the stop button on the transmitter for 5 seconds. The motor will shunt and then press and hold the PROG button on the transmitter for 7 seconds. The motor will initially shunt once and then it will shunt twice more to confirm the action. You've now reset the motor to the factory default settings. Thank you for watching. For any more information, please don't hesitate to get in touch. Either call us on 01268 570 900 or drop us an email to inquiries at udell.co.uk.